All right. For this assignment, I chose to do problem number 13 on page 2 of the worksheet of the Add and Subtract Integers Investigation Worksheet. So on this, we have negative 3 plus 9. Now that's a little complicated whenever there's a negative in our equation. But we have to remember that we read and we do math when it's left to right. We do this when there's no extended order of operations we need. All we need and for this equation is addition. That is the only sign here. So we're just going to approach this left to right. So we're going to start with our negative 3. What does it mean for a number to be negative? Which side of the 0 is it on? Is it on the left side or the right side? Well, in this, it's on the left side because it's negative. And with it, with it being negative 3, that'll mean that it'll be 3 leaps away from our 0. So 1, 2, 3. And we got to negative 3 right here. We're at the very beginning of this problem, and we're, at, we're pretty close to zero here. So our placeholder with three leaps over is a negative three. Now we also know that we still have that nine. Our nine is positive. There's no negative sign by it. So we know when we're dealing with positive numbers, we travel to the right of the zero. So that's what we're going to do now. We're going to take our negative three, and we're going to add nine positive leaps to it going to the right. So starting here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. And we ended right here where it says positive 6. Therefore, our answer to negative 3 plus 9 would be 6.